everyone, welcome back to another video. What's going on everybody? It's convention day, woo! -hoo! A little it rainy is, out here right now. <laughs> yeah, it is actually raining as we're walking up. Um, we're going to the Deland Toy and Comic Convention. So we're walking up right now. It is a pretty rainy day, but hey, we're still here and we're excited to see what they got. Yeah, it should be a fun one. Pedro's in there right now. We're gonna go say hi and check out what they have. We don't know how good the audio is. It's a little windy out here, yeah. so we'll bring you guys back once we get inside. See you guys inside. All right, we're in the convention. Give you guys a nice little pan around. Lots of comics, as you guys can see over there. So we're gonna get our tags right now. So we're here, got some cool comics everywhere we look. Sarah's behind us recording on the live stream. If anybody's here at the live stream, say what's up. So we're gonna go through lots of cool stuff here. Everybody knows I like digging. Some birds of prey, some black cat. We're not looking for anything specific. It was like Captain America. Let's see what kind of prices we got on some of this stuff. Eight dollars. Some nice Captain America stuff. Let's see what they got on the wall over there. They got anything cool on the wall? Some Spider-Man. See if we can find out some Volume One Avengers. Love me some Avengers. Five dollars Avengers. Not bad. Nice two dollar comics right there. Not bad for two bucks. Nice condition. Let's go over here to some some Hulk. Uh, nice 181 reprint. Got some nice stuff here. Some of this Hulk. Some nice five dollars on Incredible Hulk. Nice condition on a lot of the stuff here too. Oh wow, three dollars. Issue 274. Some really nice Incredible Hulk. Let's see what else we can find. Some Iron Man. Some nice older Iron Man. Two dollars for issue 67. Wow. Let's see if they got anything else. The web Spider-Man on the wall there. And then some Wolverine. Doesn't look like they have any. Thing too old. Lots of cool classic Marvel Comics toys. Some older stuff here. Really cool booth right here. Look who we got. Hey! What's going on, man? How you doing? Good, good, good. Just coming to check out the show. Lots of cool booths here today. Yeah, man. Check out what Pedro's got, guys. Some nice dollar comics. Uncanny uh, X-Men. Ooh, dollar Uncanny X-Men. Maybe we might have to dig through some of Pedro's stuff here, see what he's got. There's some more Avengers stuff, some more volume one Avengers. There's some of the cool toys. See a lot of nicer keys we got up here. Some nice Tales to Astonish. Looks like someone found it right here. More X-Men over here. Some uncanny X-Men. Ooh, there you go. New Giant Man costume. What is that, issue 65? 50 bucks. There's a nice Submariner book right there. He's got a lot of nice Thor here too. $10 on that Thor. Here's some Marvel Comics Presents. Really nice Wolverine covers on a lot of these. Some Marvel Premiere with some Iron Fist. Looks like we found a nice booth here also. Some cool stuff. 316 right here. Nice price. 9.0375. Some old Batman. Look at that. Got a classic Todd McFarlane. Oh, everybody knows that. Hot book right now. First Falcon. Let's see what we can find in the raw stuff. Action comics. Let's see what they got for Avengers. There's Avengers. Avengers issue 56. $25. 25 bucks on that one also. Avengers Volume 1 doesn't get enough love these days. Really nice Black Panther issue two for twenty dollars. Some more Captain America twenty dollars. Oh, we got some Daredevil. I'm looking for issue nine right now. We're looking for issue one seventy also. So let's see if he has issue one seventy. Oh, he does not. Oh wow, that's a seven point five. That's a really nice book right there. Detective one sixty eight. Here's some old Flash here. Some really nice old Flash, 12 cent issue 144, 10 bucks. Some nice old 12 cent Spectre. Huge sales going on. Hope you guys are excited for the video. So many booths to hit though, so we gotta walk around more. Found a whole bunch of amazing Spider-Man comics here. But you guys, we think this stuff is cool. Some really good prices. Maybe see if we'll cut me a little bit of a deal on some of these. Some later issues. He doesn't have any super big keys. But definitely some nice stuff. G.I. Joe, Old Green Lantern. Ooh, look at that right there. Moon Knight issue 2, 17 bucks. There's another one right here, issue 4 for 12. Some really nice Moon Knight stuff here. Moon Knight's heating up right now. Some Submariner, Submariner stuff's hot right now too. There's comics everywhere at this convention. So many comics. Some Lady Death, Green Arrow, some newer stuff. These are $2 comics right here. $1 comics right here. 
Love me one dollar comics. Some amazing Spider-Man right here. Issue 200. That's nice. 25 bucks. Oh, look at that. Same comic that other guy had, except this one's 10 bucks. All right, our first purchase of the convention. Pretty good one, if you ask me. A nice copy of Spider-Man 204. And I picked myself up another issue, 328. Classic Todd McFarlane art. I found a really cool booth here, but prices are a little, a little high on some of these books. $25. Here's some more Silver Age DC. Lots of nice stuff, but $125. Nice stuff, but a little, little expensive for my taste. Found another cool booth here. Let's go through. First appearance of Electra. That's a really nice book. First new Nightwing. They got Black Cat. Wolverine issue one for 40 bucks. That's not a bad price either. There's a bunch of really nice Hulk books here. Some really good prices Thanks on a lot of these stuff. The, uh, this one right here, this is a nice book. Classic Todd McFarlane on issue 345. Some nice Inhuman stuff. Found a really nice booth here, guys, with some really nicely priced Amazing Spider-Man stuff. Here's some really nice older ones, 60 bucks. $45 on that one. We got some nice stuff. They have a really nice copy of issue 47 for 70 bucks though. Beautiful comic. Presents very well. Some really nice stuff. 10 bucks. Issue 87. They're not in the best of shape, but still very nice books. Found some cool original art here also. You gotta love original art piece. Terry and the Pirates. This is a cool book too for all you guys speculating on Blade. His first solo series. Some incredible Hulk. There's issue five and a 3.5. Looks like we found ourselves another really cool booth. Got some cool old toys here, but they have a lot of nice covers here. Lots of nice J. Scott Campbell stuff from Gen 13. We got another huge booth right here. It looks like they got some awesome keys back there. I don't know if you guys can see, but they have the first Swordmaster right there, or Swordsman, first Gambit right up there. Lots of really nice keys. They got their stuff color-coded, it looks like, as you can see by the stickers. Nice issue 101, first Morbius. 121. Oh, this is a cool book too. What if first James Foster as a uh, Thor? And that's one of the what ifs that came true. That's a cool yeah. yeah. That's a cool book right there too. First Mystique. Nice Avengers. Oh, there you go. Cool book right there. First War Machine. This book is hot, but very expensive these days. Oh, here's another nice one. First in Humans. 195. Black Cat. $200. Newsstand. Some more amazing Spider-Man and Avengers. This is a very nice box. 750 bucks is what they're asking for that. Lenny's booth has got some really nice stuff back here. Spineworks does some great work on all the comic books for a lot of the local guys over here in Florida and a lot of people all over. 125. Oh, yeah. First War Machine has a really clean copy too. That is really clean. Super clean. That's the complete set. Oh, that's the complete oh. Secret War set. Yeah, with I'm, issue I'm selling it as a complete set. Oh, I think wow, that's, that's a nice. pretty good deal. 350 the bucks set. for the whole set. We got one stop shop over here. I'm here with the guys from the comic shop. Geo found himself a really cool looking copy of Fantastic Four issue one. He's definitely. Oh, no. Have you heard of this? Is this, is this something? In a rough shape. I don't know. It. It's still complete. Even the corners are there. That's no, no, amazing. No, no, no. Alright, found another booth, gonna go through. Really some cool booth, some $3 Spider-Man stuff. This is a cool book you don't see too often. Yeah. Strange Adventures 205, first Dead Man. Got another Wolverine one. Cool book right there. This is a cool book too. First record. I think we're gonna get this Captain America, Sam Wilson, number three. And then we have Marvel Comic Presents before Wolverine. There was Weapon X, 72. And then Angelo is still digging, so we'll bring you guys back once we find some more stuff. That's a pretty cool book in this box. Yeah, this is, this is a really cool book, especially with the new Morbius movie coming out. They actually got a couple different issues here, all different grades. This is a nice box though. Here's a nice little Super Mario. Mario Brothers comic, some Alien. This is a cool ALF, the uh, recall cover. This is a really nice one. Amazing Spider-Man 15, first Kraven the Hunter. This is another cool little key right here. First Man Wolf. That. Oh wow, look at that. First Punisher, very nice copy. Clean issue 129. Got a couple copies of that. Lots of nice, amazing Spider-Man stuff. Oh, here you go, 300. Oh, here you go. Annual number one. First Sinister Six. Oh, there you go, some old Batman. Oh, what is that, Batman number 75? Really old Batman stuff. Number 119. 
There's your 144. Alrighty, so that's gonna cut out the day for us. We got some really awesome stuff, and I just wanted to say really quickly, thank you to everybody that walked up to us and said hi. We met so many of the subscribers. You guys are so cool walking up and showing us all the cool stuff you bought. We hope we see more of you guys at next week's show, but we're gonna show you quickly some of the cool stuff we picked up. Here's a really nice, amazing Spider-Man 298. Picked that up for $20, really steal of a deal. This was probably the book of the day for yeah, me absolutely. that I'm more excited about. John Romita artwork. We got this for 60 bucks. It's a very clean copy. We went through it already. Third appearance of Black Cat 204 Amazing Spider-Man. Picked that up for $10 along with this awesome Todd McFarlane issue 238. I was also able to pick up a $15 copy of Wolverine issue 88. For those of you unaware, this is the first battle between Wolverine and Deadpool. Really cool comic. This was a nice little $5 pickup. Transformers issue 8. First appearance of the Dinobots. This is another cool book. First Puma 256. This was a nice $5 pickup. This one was really cool. Also beautiful copy. Peter Parker Spectacular Spider-Man issue 90. Beautiful black cat cover on there. Picked it up for $20, but this gentleman at the booth gave us a great deal. And yes, we did find a very minty, beautiful copy of Daredevil issue 9 for my collection. So now I own issue 9 through 200 with some fillers I gotta fill in. We also picked up this beautiful copy of Adventure into Fear issue 20. Really nice um, a Morbius key right here with the movie coming out. I thought that would be a pretty cool pickup. This was a nice one too. These books are definitely undervalued. First uh, Weapon X appearance, $35 pickup. Marvel Comics Presents issue 72. And then this was a nice pickup also. $20 is a little low if you ask me on this one. Sam Wilson, Captain America issue three. Really nice stuff. All right, everyone, we hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks again to everyone who said hi to us. We're always excited to see you guys in person. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching what we picked up today and seeing all the different booths. Yeah, sun's in my eyes, so we're going to get out of here quickly, guys. We'll see you next week on the video at the tent sale. Hope you have a great day. Bye, guys.